Hey guys, it's Leanne. Welcome to my YouTube channel if you're new here. If you're not new then of course welcome back and thanks so much for subscribing and returning to my channel. So I just need to explain why I've got two different eyeshadow looks on. So I was trying out new looks, just experimenting. I'm doing a poll on my Instagram and I want to see which eye people prefer and whichever one they do prefer, whichever eye wins, that's the look I'm going to be doing a tutorial on. So anyone on YouTube can be included as well. So Leave me a comment down below and let me know which eyeshadow look you prefer. I'll just give you a closer little look. So they're both cookie style. This one is just more exaggerated and this one is just a little bit more natural. Please subscribe before we jump in and also follow me over on Instagram which I will leave on screen somewhere. Today's video is just a video on my makeup giveaway which it's a competition I'm doing over on Instagram and the point of my makeup giveaway is just to help me reach 1,000 subscribers, which is my first short-term goal for YouTube. I just thought I'd do a video to let everyone know what prizes are up for grabs and how to enter. I'm just going to talk you through all the different products that are in the giveaway. So we'll start with one of my favourite products. It's the Jeffree Star Mini Breaker Palette. So it's the mini version of the Jaw Breaker Palette. All the shades are very highly pigmented, amazing quality, cruelty-free. And then another Jeffree Star product that I have, which is just so cute and so amazing, is the Jeffree Star Mirror. I thought I can't do a makeup giveaway and not buy one of these because who doesn't want one of these? I've got a little green one on and I'm always using this. It's just a nice little addition to your dressing table and obviously I use it for my YouTube videos as well. There's my little... And I got it in pink, but I'm so jealous now because I want the pink one but I really do love the baby pink one. Now, the next eyeshadow palette I bought was the Be Perfect Cosmetics Makeup With Jar Clientele Palette. The eyeshadow quality is meant to be amazing, and I do actually like this brand anyway. They're cruelty-free as well, just a little side note. Most of the products I've picked for this makeup giveaway competition, most of the products are cruelty-free. And there's the shades on the back. It's got loads of nice, gorgeous, pigmented and varied colours. But that'd be a good palette to have in anyone's kit, just for even if you are a makeup artist or even if you're not, that'd just be quite a good palette to have anyway. It does seem to have a lot of the shades that I seem to use a lot in my everyday life, but also on clients as well. It's called the clientele palette, but yeah, good for your own personal use as well. Now, the next palette is a highlight palette. This is a collaboration between one of my favourite makeup artists ever, who I had the pleasure of meeting at one of his masterclasses, and Be Perfect Cosmetics. It's the Sub-Zero palette and it's by Mamma Mitchell and Be Perfect Cosmetics. It's got six highlights in and I actually really want this myself. The shades look amazing, it looks bland and I've tried to choose like really good, good products that I'd really want to win. And that was only to try and entice people to subscribe to my YouTube channel. So I thought I need to get like the best products that I possibly can to like, you know entice people to subscribe so that's why i've ended up buying all these goodies now i'm going to be moving on to the brushes now there is a real techniques face and body blender this brush would be good for like going you know if you had a bit of foundation down the neck or on the collarbones or anything like that that'd be a really good brush for that now i've also included a real techniques brush set this is the flawless base set and there's a little brush holder in there as well and i also got another the real technique set so this one includes the miracle complexion sponge blush brush and this is the everyday essential set so you've got the everyday essential set and the flawless base set they'd be a great addition to anyone's makeup kit i personally love real techniques brushes i think for the quality and the value I still go back to them now even though i do use other brands another brush that i chose this is the spectrum 8m brush and the olivia hale makeup applicator sponge it looks kind of similar to the real techniques sponge whoever wins could maybe try out the real techniques maybe this is a dupe so yeah so i've also bought some primers i've included the elf luminous putty primer i use the poreless putty primer which is amazing so i'm assuming that the elf luminous putty primer will be just as good yeah i've also included the fenty beauty soft matte pro filter instant retouch primer now it really does make your makeup last all day i really do notice a difference in makeup lasting when I use this on myself client. So drugstore, high end, I've included a little bit of everything. So I've also put in the Mario Badescu facial spray. I use this to 
refresh my makeup throughout the day and I also used to use it as a setting spray so I've also included a makeup revolution glow fix illuminating spray another product that I bought was a Fenty Beauty highlight this is the kilowatt freestyle highlighter duo and the shades that i bought it in was afternoon snack and mo honey another highlighter was the elf jelly highlighter and that's in the shade bubbly another brush that i bought was the olivia hale blush brush again this could be a dupe for the real techniques blush brush which is this one so they are very very similar whoever wins this obviously you can have the real deal and then you can have maybe the dupe whoever does win this please let me know what you think of the products some contour products now the Barry M Chisel Cheeks Contour Creams. So there's a highlight shade, which is the cream one, and there's a brown shade, which is the contour one. But I'd say this is more for a medium skin tone. So I also bought the Revolution Bronzer. It looks like it's got a little bit of shimmer in, but I quite like that in bronzer. Another Revolution product now. So this is the Revolution Powder in the shade Translucent. I picked this because it is translucent, and that means it should be suitable for every skin tone because it doesn't have a colour to it just to try and be inclusive of all skin tones now again another revolution product so this is the revolution pro lipstick collection and there's five matte reds so they're all different shades from deep to maybe a little bit of a vibrant red the last revolution product is a lip liner so the revolution renaissance lip liner in the shade classic so obviously that would go perfectly well with any one of these shades now another elf product so this is the elf mascara it's the three in one mascara it's just in the shade very black i used to use this mascara and i personally love it so i know from experience it's a brilliant mascara another lip liner that i bought was the la girl lip liner in the shade spice it just looks like a nice nice brownie shade i bought the collection glam crystals dazzling gel liner now i love these products i so i just use these normally so where i've got a cut crease here you see that line i'd normally just trace out this line with a bit of glitter and it just literally takes your makeup game to the next level so i got one in a gold shade which is called funk and then I got one in a blue shade, which is called Le Freak. Now, I've also included a little bit of skincare in this. One of my favourite skincare brands is The Ordinary. Their products have been life-changing for my skin, personally, in terms of blemishes and in terms of just how how much confidence I now have going without makeup. I genuinely credit it to drinking more water and using their products. This is The Ordinary Plant Derived Hemi Squalene and it's one of my favourite brands so I couldn't not include it in a makeup giveaway that I'd love to win. I picked up the I Love Revolution Coffee Fizzer. It's just a little coffee bath, bath bomb. <laughs> just a coffee bath bomb. And I also picked up a little chocolate dip donut bath bomb as well and that's also by Revolution. So you've got two bath bombs. I also got one of my favourite shower gels which is the Soap and Glory Clean On Me. Now I've also included some face masks. So there's a black seaweed face mask, peel off face mask and a cucumber peel off. Obviously this makeup bag is not going to fit in all of these products because there's so many products I really did go in. I probably went a bit too overboard on this giveaway but obviously I want to achieve my goals and it would be nice to help someone who whoever wins this obviously it's going to be like amazing for them isn't it so this bag i just thought i'll include this as a little toiletries bag now, i obviously didn't forget the makeup remover cloths so i personally use these to take off my makeup and they are so effective they're reusable as well so they're obviously better for the environment better than baby wipes they're more gentler on your skin i thought i can't not include them because that's something that if you're going to be using all this makeup like you're going to have to have a way to get it off so i thought i'd include them because they're a personal favorite of mine as well now almost there guys lastly i brought some jewels so these are for the creative people or i would say anyone going to a festival this year but obviously that's not going to happen do with them what you will also i got some lashes these are just the individual lashes from primark and these are bottom lashes so that go on your bottom eyelashes from peaches and creams and they're in the number 11 yes this is the giveaway and there's still time to enter i'm not at 1000 subscribers yet as you can probably tell already but i do want to be so if you go on over to my instagram that's where you need to enter i'll just go over the rules really quick now to win all of these products that you've just seen me talk about all you've got to do is be following my instagram which is going to be on screen now 
and you need to be subscribed to my YouTube channel. You do have to have an account to subscribe. I've been getting a lot of messages from people saying, oh, well, I watch your videos, but like, I can't subscribe because I don't have an account. Unfortunately, I just can't enter anyone who doesn't subscribe to my YouTube channel, as that's the whole point why I'm doing this, to gain me subscribers up. So I'm sorry if anyone doesn't have an account, but it takes two seconds to make one, and obviously, you've got to be in it to win it. So it could be the best two seconds of your life. You know what I mean? If you got to win all these products, I mean, I'd be made up if I won. So, so you have to subscribe to my YouTube channel and send me a screenshot, send me a picture that you are subscribed to my YouTube channel. So send me that via DM over on Instagram. The third rule was tag three people in the post on Instagram. Also, more people can see it, more people can subscribe. So you're promoting it for me. And then tag me in your story on Instagram. Hopefully that is not too much to do. Good luck to anyone who enters this competition after seeing this video. Please subscribe before you leave. Please turn on the notification bell. Follow me on Instagram and go and enter and good luck. So thank you so much for watching guys. I will see you in the next tutorial and the winner will be getting revealed when I reach 1000 subscribers.